Oh, NBL Live is back. Good to be back on the home network. Hope everyone is doing well. We got a little late night Monday night action, and we have a phenomenal game coming up. It's the Detroit Lions taking on the New York Giants on NBL Live Broadcast 294. Before we get there, though, we've got our NBL Live pregame show brought to you each and every week by our clothing sponsor, Came From Nothing Clothing. You can see the wide array of streetwear you can get from our partners over at CFN Clothing. We got our Virginia Beach collection. NBL's taking over Virginia Beach in just about a month. And you too can wear the clothing that we are going to be wearing while we're down on the shores of Virginia Beach. Tanks, shirts, board shorts, a little bit of everything. Uh, if you want to check out all the uh, Virginia Beach collection, the regular collection, and of course our EA Access collection, you got two places to do it. You can do it at 365.maddenbomberleague.com slash merchandise, or you can go straight to the source and go to cfnclothing.com. Click on the MBL tab. Reminder, guys, those EA Access shirts are for sale, uh, and they are, uh, they're they're going hot, and 50% of the proceeds go to Operation Homefront, our charity partner for our EA Access tournament. Make sure you get yourselves uh, shirts for everybody because it's for a great cause, and they're pretty sweet shirts. Uh, we got a great game for you. Lions taking on the Giants, Bomber and Cringe, a matchup we have seen uh, a lot over this cycle. Maybe the last time we have it, who knows what happens in the playoffs, but this has become a very much a rivalry here in the NBL between two of the powers in the NFC. Uh, let's take a look at the players to watch for today's games. Let's start out with the New York Giants, and who else but Saquon Barkley. He is having another phenomenal season. 618 yards going into, what are we in, week 7, week 8? 6.6 uh, 6 per carry, 10 touchdowns. Uh, only one fumble. Uh, for the Giants, their key against the Lions is just to get the ball rolling on the ground. If they can get Barkley going, I like them in this game because uh, the Lions like um, to, to air the ball out. If they can, if the Giants can control time of possession on the ground, that's where they're going to have some success uh, by by keeping the ball in their offense hand, keeping that Lions defense on the field. The last thing you want is to give the Lions too many offensive possessions. So getting the ball rolling with Saquon Barkley is key. Uh, on the flip side, how about Eric Ebron? Back in Detroit, twenty one receptions, three hundred ninety one yards, three touchdowns. Uh, at 18.6 receiving average. Shout out to Deck Dog in the chat. What's going on, Deck? Good to see you, my friend. Happy Monday uh, for the uh, the uh, the Detroit Lions. Um, their key is going to be to involve as many receivers as possible. It's something that uh, the the Lions do very well. What's up, Bogey Express? Good to see you. Shout out to Under. Shout out to everybody who's stri who uh, uh, re up their sub during the the pregame. I know there were a bunch of you, but appreciate everybody. Um, they got to get a lot of people involved. Uh, the the uh, Giants are going to try to lock down DeAndre Hopkins. So getting some catches to Eric Ebron, to Corey Coleman, to whoever it is, the Lions got to spread the ball out um, and and find a way to get more of those guys involved other than D-Hop. Because if it's just a D-Hop game, uh, the Giants are going to be able to double him, going to be able to lock him down. And the Lions don't really have a rushing attack this year. Um, without Malik Holly, they, they don't run the ball particularly effectively. Um, so... It's going to be important for the Lions to spread the ball out in the passing attack. Let's take a look at who our Bleach Report team sees winning this NBA Live Week 8 action. Broadcast 294 split. As down the middle as you can get with seven people picking. Lions with a slight edge. Cougs, Adams, J Adam, JB, and Gibbs all taking the Detroit Lions. On the flip side, Draco, Double A, and Game Master taking the New York Giants. Uh, before I give my pick. We, we just announced it. It's over on our YouTube page. Make sure you apply to our third annual NBL EA Access Tournament. Here's all the information. we got a video on our YouTube, youtube.com slash Madden Bomber League. 
Details of the entire tournament we announced today that our, our prizes uh, include a top prize in the tournaments, a Patrick Mahomes signed helmet to both a winner on Xbox One and PlayStation 4, um, as well as a uh, airfare hotel and two tickets to a Cleveland Browns game. Um, it, all the information is youtube.com slash Madden Bomber League. Make sure you check it out. Again, it's all for charity. You see that Operation Homefront logo? Uh, we're very passionate about it. It helps our military families. Um, the entire, all donations we get during the tournament go into Operation Homefront. Last year, we raised $5,300 and change. Um, we're hoping to do more than that. We'll talk about more stretch goals and uh, prizes they get announced. That'll be all over on YouTube and on our Twitters at MBL Network at Bomber League. Um, but, uh, also fun fact, all of our subscribing, all, all the money we get from subscribers, whether you subscribe with Twitch prime or with your own money. Um, if you subscribe to the NBL during the month of July, you're going to get entered to win, uh, that, uh, that trip to Cleveland as well as, uh, all that money that we get for those subscribers. That's all going right back to operation Homefront. So it's, uh, if you just want to subscribe, uh, it's, it's going to be, uh, it, it's a great way to get involved, give some money to a great uh, cause. All right, uh, prediction time, then we'll get it out to the game. I think there's going to be a uh, close battle. I know a lot of... I'm not jumping out of a plane. I hope not, Decca. Um, I think there's going to be a close battle. Um, a, a, two sort of conflicting styles. The Giants, with Seiko and Bunkle, they actually do like to air it out a lot. Um, but I think they're going to use their ground game. Um, I'm going to take the New York Giants in this one. I think it's going to be a close game. Give me the Giants. Uh, I'm going to say 27-21 uh, in this game. Um, in a in a battle that I think is going to come down, I, I, I think uh, the Lions are going to run out of steam towards the end of the game. I think this is going to be a tight game. It could get to double digits towards that end of the game, but I got the Giants uh, by six in this one, 27-21. I'll tell these guys to get going, uh, and then we can get this ball game underway. NBA Live broadcast 294, uh, and uh, it's going to be a great one. This is a matchup we have seen too many times in the playoffs. It's a matchup we've seen a lot throughout the cycle, and this may be the last time you see it on NBA Live. Let's get right out there. Appreciate everybody hanging out for the NBA Live pregame show, but it is game time. Coming up next, a battle between two of the NFC powers. It is the New York Giants, the Detroit Lions. It's all coming up right now here on NBA Live. I just want to say, hey, man, this is T.O., the cover athlete of the Madden 19 Hall of Fame edition, and you're watching the gold standard of the franchise mode, the MBL Network. Holla. And we are live. It's MBL Live Broadcast 294 here on the MBL Network. Final season of Madden 19 continues. We got Week 8 action. It's the Lions taking on the Giants in a battle of two NFC powerhouses. A matchup we have seen both in the regular season and in the playoffs. They've battled for NFC championships. They're battling midseason here in the MBL. So happy to have you along with us. Excited that you are joining us for a phenomenal night of MBL Live action. A little, uh... A little late start here. Doing a little 10 o'clock game. I want to make sure we got a game out. I think there's some scheduling with uh, Cringe because he's got such a budding social life. He couldn't make a 9 o'clock game. So a little mix up. We're going to do a little 9 o'clock, uh, a little 10 o'clock game. We'll be back to our 9 o'clock starts on Wednesday. Um, and I said in the chat, I think he's still there. We'll start scheduling Wednesday, Welcome please. to the network, baby. Hey, just look at that timing. That's just awesome timing. Shout out to Nice Lady with the 17 months. Uh, it's going to be the Detroit Lions starting off with the ball first. First and 10, two tight end set. It's going to be a handoff to Austin Eckler over the left side. Big hit taken at the 33-yard line. Hilt pick up eight. Austin Eckler taking over from Malik Ali in the, uh, who went in the offseason and left the Detroit Lions. Eckler, very serviceable back. Dude, don't act like you were going to sleep. Let's all settle down. I've got to give a big shout out, by the way, to JB. He's in the chat. Uh, he did all our graphics uh, on very short notice, like put them together uh, it, within like 45 minutes for our uh, our EA Access information show. Um, I know it was short notice, but big shout out to JB who was uh, uh, who who really just did it without even asking a question and really made that show look very good. You can check out that video youtubecom slash League. Make sure you apply. I'm not. I, I don't want to. I don't want to 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 spread rumors. Okay. Applications have been open for three hours, uh, and Welcome we have. Network, baby. 
40 responses already. Remember, it's rolling applications on both consoles. So the earlier you apply, the better chance you have to get in. Shout out to Ric Flair with the Twitch Prime sub for 11 months. Third and four. Cam Newton dropping back. Looks over the middle of the field. Inaccurate pass. And how about a stop on the first drive for the New York Giants? Looking underneath. Had a man, it looked like, but just inaccurate for Wham Bam. Thank you, Cam. And the New York Giants are going to get a stop. Scarlet Knight 531. Cam Newton with the lines. No Stafford or rookie QB. Don't know how I feel about my favorite squad right now. Stafford lasted a while. Uh, I think it was three or four seasons. Um, but the line, here's the thing, Scarlet Knight. Lions never really draft that high. Um, they're perpetually a bottom of the first round drafter, so it's tough to get quarterbacks, especially in this league. Now we can see this New York Giants offense come out. Led by, of course, their, their star halfback, Saquon Barkley, out of Penn State University. First down and 10. How about a three tight end set to start the game? And how about a handoff to Saquon? Spins inside, but good job staying with him. Uh, that's a nice tackle after a seven-yard gain. Could have been more, but Gerard Davis, one of the most sure tacklers in the NBL. Duber saying Cam is buns. Colonel Sanders saying Cam is basura. It's trash. Second down and three. Two wide receivers split out to the left side. Odell Beckham still on the New York Giants, still putting up numbers. Evan Ingram, the tight end, also a big target. How about Saquon Barkley the one more time? He'll pick up a first down to the 36-yard line. Give him six. Fuji saying Barkley is a chest ode. I will not, I will not read your correction. I'm going with it. He's a chest ode for sure. By the way, appreciate everybody who, uh, so many kind words after DreamHack. Uh, those are such a great tournament to go down and work for and uh, had some fun at EA Play, but we're back to it. Back to NBL Live uh, and uh, trying to close out this season strong. Working towards broadcast 300. First and 10. How about a play action pass? Looking over right side, little corner route. How about Odell Beckham? That's Graham Foote. Not to be confused with Jordan Foote, the greatest quarterback in the history of the NFL. That is uh, 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 Graham Foot. Duber saying that shout out was much appreciated. Dreamhack, absolutely, man. I try to shout out all my NBL guys when I see them uh, in the chat tuning into those stuff, and I appreciate you, Dupes, tuning in each and every week on NBL Live or on the multitude of things I do. So, toss play, left side, Barkley, just gonna pick up a yard. Nice coverage there on the outside. Not letting that toss play stretch the field. Yeah, Jordan Foote is the greatest quarterback in the history of. The NFL, I mean, the world, this, the galaxy, he's so good. Yeah, Ric Flair, OBG on the Browns can be nasty. And uh, if you're a subscriber to the NBL, you're entered into that giveaway. It is two tickets. You can take me if you want, but it's two tickets to the uh, to a Browns game where you're choosing. We'll give you a choice of six games. Uh, airfare, hotel, all paid for. So an all-expenses trip to, to Cleveland, which doesn't sound that exciting, but the Browns are actually... Uh, going to be sort of fun to watch. It's a nice throw to the right side. That's Culberson with the catch. He'll go out of bounds at the 22-yard line. I assume Jordan Foote is off limits forever. That's my assumption. Uh, but it's going to be a fun weekend. Um, depending on the game, I will probably go to the, to the game uh, uh, no matter what. So uh, make sure to buy you a drink when you're out there. But uh, it's going uh, to be a good, uh, a good time in Cleveland. First down to 10 now for the New York Giants. Three wide set over to left side. Evan Ingram, right side of the formation. Saquon Barkley in the backfield with Graham Foote. Foote's going to take the snap on first and 10. Good coverage downfield. And the pressure finally gets there and forces an incomplete pass. Uh, Decade, yes, Crown Apple will be uh, will be the drink of choice for sure. Uh, just not that that Jack Fireball, no, the Jack the Jack Cinnamon, no, but Crown Apple. Although I don't know if I can drink Crown Apple ever anymore after Coogs threw it all up on the porch and the whole porch smelled like like cinnamon apple. But uh, I love me some Crown Apple. I think I think we can still push through. Second down to ten, three wide receivers set once again. How about a toss play to Saquon Barkley? Good shed out there by Morrison. He's gonna make the tackle in the backfield and finally the defense standing up tall. Big third and 12, and not a lot of room for the New York Giants offense to work downfield. 
So look for this to be a tough conversion for Graham Foote and the Giants. It's going to be Foote in the shotgun, a little gun bunch action. Beckham split out wide left, Barkley in the left hip of foot. He'll take the snap on third and 12. Four-man rush, looks right side. Ooh, oh, that could have been a pick. It looked like Bomber clicked on and had the read. Instead, makes just makes the tackle, and it's going to still force the Giants to settle for a field goal. Kick is up and good. 3-0 the score. Sklam in the chat, our BR lead, saying newly re-signed Josiah Morrison signed a five-year, $32.7 million extension. Well, Motor, you say you can't sell for three, but the Giants did get a stop on the first drive, so they're on the, they are ahead of the clock right now. And now can the Giants force another three and out or another punt? As on the first drive, we saw two runs, one by Derrick Henry, one by Austin Eckler, and then an inaccurate throw on third and four, something you don't see too often from Cam Newton. Now... Cam's going to come back out and try to lead this offense first and 10. They got a little switch route on the left side with a crossing route coming from the right side. Looks like he's going to change the play. You know he's going to be looking for Coleman on that post route. He's in the slot on the left side, but they're going to pick up five. A little aggressive on the D-line. That's Olivier Vernon, also a Cleveland Brown now, with five yards. Scarlet Knight, Kerryon Johnson, I think, was gone pretty early. He wasn't very good at uh, launch of Madden. First out of five. Cam. Hey, look left side. This one's on the money to Eric Ebron. Back. Oh, he broke a tackle. He's in the open field. I don't. Did did he just fall down because he didn't like the animation? What? I didn't think that was one of those, like, the animation... Like, I, usually when you see that, it's like Madden messes up. It's the old tackle. He goes down, but the uh, the the game doesn't recognize that it was a, it was a tackle. Did, it, did his knee touch the ground? I couldn't really see. First and ten. Cam. Left side. He's got Ebron one more time. That time he just sort of... Died. I, I, don't, I don't know what happened. I don't know if, if somebody saw an animation that I didn't. It looked like a truck animation to me. Um, that that looked like a truck animation to me, but a clue bomber thought maybe that the game messed up. It did the honorable thing and falling down. I, I thought it was just a straight-up truck animation. Uh, first and 10 now for the Lions. They're at the 21-yard uh, line. How about a toss play to Austin Eckler? Good tackle on the edge. Great early penetration. That was send line with the tackle. So bring up a second along. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. It, I, I, I thought it was just Eric Ebron breaking tackles. We'll find out from him post game. Second and 13. Two wide receivers over to the left side. Two tight ends down on the line of scrimmage for Cam Newton. Uh, and uh, he's going to pick up five as the Giants. Very aggressive. That's the second offsides on the play. So instead of uh, picking up a, a nice nice defensive stop on, on first down, it's going to be second and eight. It, it, that, that loss meant nothing. Now it comes off as a two-yard gain. Second down and eight. Cam dropping back. Blitz picked up nicely. He's going to float it out left side. Trying to find Hopkins. Two feet inbounds. Give him the tutty. D-hop with the big touchdown on the left side. What a beautiful throw from Cam Newton. The Lions back on top. It's upheld. It's a 6-3 ball game. Yeah, right, I'm watching. I'm watching this clip. Thank you, Sklam. That's just a truck. I don't know why he felt I, that wouldn't. Uh, trust me, I err more on the side of like being the honorable guy. If if a Madden glitch happens or something, just fall down and take it. But that I I, I would if he had scored a touchdown there, I wouldn't even have had a second thought about it. Nonetheless, Lions up 7-3. to three. Somebody let me know in the chat. What? First 
First and ten handoff. Nope, play action pass. He's looking deep. He's looking to the corner route. Feed inbounds. Nice catch on the right side. All right, hold on one second. Welcome to the network, baby. All right, there you go. There's a poll. Let me know if you would have fallen down for that one. Big Cap. He's in the chat. What's going on, Cap? Good to see you, my friend. So you already applied for the EA Access Tournament. You know what's good. You want that uh that that Patty Mahomes helmet. Big shout out to Big Cap, one of the good friends of the network. First and ten now for the New York Giants as we've hit the second quarter. Down seven to three. Hand off to Saquon Barkley, left side. He's got some room. Good blocking on the edge. He's got a lot of room. One man to beat. Good user to tackle. And Morrison brings down Barkley, but not after a big gain to the 31 yard line. And now, first and 10 for the Giants as they're in business once again. They were stopped inside the 30 yard line on their last drive. Let's see what they can do here. First and ten. Looking over the middle of the field. Brad left the party. Brad, why aren't you talking to Bomber anymore? Kept saying, got to my, redeem myself after last year. Kept, did you get all uh, all set up for your uh, your MLB tournament? Uh, I hope Darcy set you up over at Operation Homefront. Kept, of course, he's he's uh, he's doing some stuff with Operation Homefront as well. A uh, great man in the community, helping to support the veterans. 7-3, your score here on NBA Live Broadcast, 294. If you haven't applied yet, I'm going to keep repeating it. Go over to 365.madambomberleague.com. Click on the EA Access Tournament. you find the application right there. It's completely free to enter, and you can get yourself some great prizes. Second now to 10, play action pass for Graham Foote. He's got time, but he's got nobody open. How about that tackle by Vaughn? A screamer in the backfield, and now third and long. Awesome, Cap. Awesome. Yeah, Brad was the D coordinator. Lost service. Actually, I 100% believe it because that truck just doesn't have great... Not a lot of bars in that truck. Third and long for Cringe and the New York Giants. Down 7-3. And this is where... Got a stop, then a field goal. But the Lions scored. You got to find a way to get a touchdown. The Lions bringing their... A very traditional third down defense for them. This is the, the uh, seven-man blitz. Six-man blitz. Only five back in zone. Here comes the pressure off the edge. It's actually picked up nicely. Uh, but Bomber loves to do that on third and long. It forces the quarterback to make a quick read. Um, if the blitz gets picked up and you have some time, you, you're able to find some open receivers. But on a third and 17, you're forced to get rid of the ball quickly. Only picks up 14 on the play. And he's going to have to settle for another field goal from the 24-yard line. This a 41-yard attempt. Kick is up. It is good. 7-6 your score. Appreciate everybody hanging out with us. A little late-night MBL action. Um, ah, Brad's back in. D coordinator back in. Uh, but uh, appreciate uh, everybody hanging out with us. We'll be back uh, Wednesday night, 10, uh, 9 o'clock Eastern time here on the NBL Network. Don't know what the games are yet. On Iceland, it's got to get on that. Just saying. On Iceland, are you there? But yeah, again, appreciate everybody who uh, uh, stayed tuned with the NBL over the last couple weeks uh, with DreamHack and EA Play. I was home for, for less than 24 hours over the last two weeks, but I'm excited to be back home and don't have anything going on for a while. Uh, so uh, it's going to be a lot of NBA Live over the next couple of weeks, so make sure you stay tuned. First and 10, Cam rolling out. Right side, that's Corey Coleman. First down to the 32-yard line. Shout out to Dr. Pepper. They're not a sponsor, I just love them. Uh, I think Sklan just wanted to see himself on the screen. 7-6 the score. Hopkins going to split out wide left. Two wide receivers, two tight ends. We play action. The pressure's there immediately, though. Oh, Evans up the middle. He shed it up mid-blitz. What a perfect call against that crossing route concept. Good mix-up of the play calling, and Cam had no chance. Loss of eight on the play. 
Rick Flair trying to sell my house. Where are you trying to? Where are you moving out of the the city? Uh, you just moving down the street. What you doing? Second and eighteen. Pressure once again. Cam gets hit. That's picked off. It's a bad throw to Coleman. And the Giants force the first turnover of the game. As they'll get great field position at the 37-yard line. A.J. Boye. Oh, Boye. A great pick. And just like that, the Giants, they've been stifled. They haven't been able to find the end zone. But a huge opportunity before the two-minute warning. You know saying? I'm watching Norbit while watching this. Why you waste your time with Norbit? Put on some Dr. Doolittle. First and ten. Pistol formation. It's going to be, uh, looks like a handoff to Saquon Barkley right up the middle. Browner trying to make the tackle. Barkley fights through it. He'll still pick up three. He's so tough to bring down. I'd like to point out I had some, I had some lasagna before this. I'm feeling a little slow. I'm a little sluggish right now. It's hitting me like a Mack truck. It was delicious, though. Second and seven. Two tight ends, two wide receivers, both wide receivers. Split out wide left. It's going to be handoff to Barkley right up the middle. Pick up another three down to the 31-yard line. Now you get into that third and four, and this is where the Giants like to be on third down because they open up the playbook. They can run the ball with Barkley. They can throw the ball. Uh, they can figure something else out, a uh, trick play, whatever it is. I expect to see the Giants throw the ball here, though, on third and short. They haven't had a lot of uh, third and manageables here inside the 30-yard uh, line. There's been a lot of third and 17s, third and 18. I actually have an opportunity here. Let's see what they decide to do. Lions coming out in the cover three. On third down and four, it's a play action pass. Looking over the middle of the field, looking for that post route. That's going to be jumped by Morrison. It's a bad read and picked off. Boy, an opportunity to take the lead and cringe chokes that away. Looking for the post route against a cover three. Bomber clicks on and makes the play. And now for your ASMR moment of the stream. Cheers, folks. Cam, left side. Has a man. That's D-Hop with some room. Spins back inside. Tackled at the 44-yard line. I don't know what happened over there. Can I get a defensive read? That was Storm Brave 1, so it's a cover 1 blitz. The perfect play call with a post wheel, and the switch route just got open. Sure, a second ASMR moment. Two minute warning. Welcome to the network, baby. This will be the worst ASMR ever. It'll be the worst ever. 23 flavors is the perfect amount. First and 10. Cam, all the time in the world. He's going to get out of the pocket. He's going to take off. He's going to take a hit. That's gotten Bonker in trouble a lot. He's very comfortable with Cam Newton taking hits, and uh, Cam will take put the ball on the ground. So all night, there are a lot of ways to cheese the CPU. Switch routes and double moves against man coverage are a major way to punt the corners. Absolutely, uh, they are. Their switch routes are great against man coverage. Uh, that's why you got to have help over the top. Against cover two, switch routes aren't as effective uh, because you, cover two man because you have the help over the top. Um, as uh, second and six, shout out to, to Jamie with the bits trying to get the. Uh, the MBL ASMR. And now a first and ten. Handoff. Austin Eckler. Give him three. It's ten o'clock. It's weird here on the MBL lives. Gets weird. Save it seven. Cam. Over the middle. Has a man. That's Ebron. Makes the catch. Go for the strip. But Ebron holds onto the ball at the 16 yard line. Nice throw by Cam Newton. Finding Eric Ebron right at the seam. Did you start? You're not an ASMR fan? He starts not into the ASMR. First and ten. Looks like he's going to have Coleman. Might be a wide receiver quick here, and it is. It's a handoff to Coleman. Cuts it back inside. Good defense, though, not to let Coleman get into the open field. 
Gibbs saying a touchdown here would be big. Give the Giants no time before half, though. Second down to seven now for the Giants. Under 30, or excuse me, for the Lions. Under 30 seconds to go. I'm putting my ear to my soda like I can hear it. I've got headphones on. I'm losing my mind. 7-6. Uh, a wildcat action. Eckler coming in motion. He hands it to Eckler. There's a lot of Giants out there on the edge. They make the tackle. He'll pick up four. Lions take their second of three timeouts. I think if you're a Lions fan, your, your perfect plan here is pick up the first down, but don't get in the end zone. Because they get stopped here. The Giants have three timeouts. They're not going to have a ton of time left, but they can certainly get into field goal range. Ebron was a player to watch, and players to watch tend to, tend to have good games on NBA Live. Appreciate everybody tuning in. NBA Live broadcast 294. 295 will be Wednesday night. I'm going to yell at an isolated. I don't know if he's still here, but I'm going to yell at him again. Throw to the swing. Oh, Henry breaks a tackle. He picks up the first down. He picks up a touchdown. How about that play from Derrick Henry showing off the strength to get into the end zone for the Lions. A huge touchdown before the half. Yeah, Derrick Henry. Or Lewis Henry. Is it Lewis Henry? All right. Big shout out to Slaying with the follow. I don't know, I saw Henry. Might be Lewis Henry. Might be Derrick Henry. He looks like Derrick Henry because he's big and he's got the dreads. Jaybird in the chat. What's going on, man? Church, Lewis Henry. Why not? I would like it if they made him different builds because they literally just took the Derrick Henry guy. He's got both Lewis Henry and Derrick Henry on the same team. Shut up. I don't know which one it was. I give up. He's got them both on the same team. What the hell? I don't know anymore. They're both in the Lions. Could have been Mark Henry. Jaybird in the chat. What's going on, man? <sighs> sure, it was Henry. Why not? Make me look foolish. It was a great throw. I don't know how that didn't come to fruition. Second 10, 12 seconds remaining. Giants all three timeouts. Uh, uh, Lions now have no timeouts. As Colonel Sanders wasn't following before, really? Or did you just unfollow so you could see your name pop up? I'm watching you. Second down to 10. Could have been Element J. Henry. Who knows? Could have been... Uh, oh, hand, hand off. Barkley's got some room. Oh, I like the run call here on... On the... On the... Uh, on the... The deep distance. I admit I unfollowed you my name. Uh, you do it again, you're out. Wait, hold on, I got this. Yeah, you're timed out. How do you feel now? How do you feel now? First and ten, handoff to Barkley. He's going to let this clock run out. We'll go into halftime. 14-6, Lions on top. Yeah, Banhammer. There you go. Don't mess with me. Throw a Hail Mary there. Why not? Uh, because Probably because you he didn't have the arm strength to get it to the end zone. Uh, and if that gets picked, if it's one of those jump picks where you get ag picked right in front of the pile, all of a sudden you've got a lot of open room. I don't, I don't mind the run play. 
Let's see where the Giants get the ball. I think the other reason is the Giants get the ball to start the second half. No need to take an unnecessary risk. 14 to 6, the score. And on first down, it's going to be Saquon Barkley trying to get to the outside. He has a stroke. Looked like he broke the tackle. The guys, it, lo it looked like he broke the tackle. And then, and then the game, the game had a stroke. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Everything's okay here on the MBL ASMR. By the way, there's somebody right now named Amor Amuranth? Amoranth? Who's doing ASMR right now? Has 2,100 viewers. Maybe we really need to start doing MBL ASMR. Yes, your name does show up. I will. I will time you out again. All right. Can somebody confirm to me? Because uh, by the way, in the in the group me, it says week seven. Is this week seven or week eight? I have no clue. I want to say it's week. Jaybird, it's like it's the the quiet sounds. That it get some people like it. It puts them. It's like a. Uh, I don't want to say it's a hypnotic technique, but it's a relaxing technique. Just figuring things out as we go. Third and six. Left side corner route. Tease with a nice play. Yeah, it is. It is. It's weird. I I don't personally like it. It does. It doesn't do anything for me. Um, there's some people who they say they get like a, a tingly sensation, like in their scalp. They get tingle. Like it. It. I, some people really like it. It. Some people. It really. Um. Fupa cheese. Are you not saying I'm a hot girl? It's uncalled for. Um, some people, it really relaxes them. It does nothing to me. It's just sort of weird. It's like people have just been like. Are you relaxed yet? Okay, I admit it. I'm not a hot girl. That's fair. Colonel Sanders, pause. Just pause. Stubers, unpause. Lions have to use a timeout. It, it, some people really like it. Uh, I don't know, but my wife and her friend just went to, uh, they went to a place, they did like the sensory deprivation chamber where you like lay in a giant egg that is completely silent and you lay in like, like, I don't know, a, a foot of water. That stuff I can't do. That I I would freak out about 12 seconds in there. Play action pass, rolling out right side. He's got RB, like, just wide open. I don't know how you leave Corey Coleman with that much space. Going for the strip doesn't get it. It's first down at the 42-yard line. I know Z started so close. What's great is, like, so for the last, like, I'll, I'll say eight weeks, it's been all work for me. Uh, with with Mudhead, with uh, DreamHack, with EA Play, it's just been work, work, work. Um, with MCS before that. Uh, but at these next couple weeks, it's all sort of fun stuff. Uh, because I, I have Mudhead next week, which I'm excited for. I get to call a game with Drag, which uh, I haven't gotten to work with Drag before, but I, I've I've only met Drag in person once. It's a nice throw. Boy, Eric Ebron is just gashing this defense. Um, I met Drag once at uh, at the club championships. But I was still, like, new, and I didn't talk to anybody. Um, but we talked on Twitter. Um, nice guy. Can't wait to call a game with him. Um, and then the week after that, I go to Vegas with my wife. And uh, her sister. Her sister's 21st birthday is that weekend. So we're taking her to Vegas, which is going to be fun. Uh, for no reason, then uh, I get to go to Vegas. Um, that's a good throwaway there. Great user coverage on the drag route. Um, and then 4th of July, I'm going up to visit a good friend of mine uh, in northern Michigan for the 4th. I'm going to go hang out and drink and look at fireworks. Uh, and then the week after that, uh, Fat flies in. We go to the MLB All-Star game the day before we leave for uh, for VB. It's going to be great. It's going to be a great couple weeks. Very excited. And plus, for the next two weeks, I don't have to move at all, which I'm excited for. Second out of 10 for the Lions looking to... what They might be able to put the game away the way the... Giants offense has been going. Throw underneath to Ebron. Boy, Eric Ebron is having himself a game. 100 on green. No. 
Nemo, you got you got this in your cash now. Guys, don't forget, by the way. Third annual MBL EA Access Tournament, July 25th to the 30th. You can apply at 365.badandbarbalink.com. Click on the EA Access Tournament. It's free to enter. It's on both platforms, and it's for charity. Make sure you get involved. Yeah, Gibbs, we're going to have a good 11-hour road trip. You, me, and Fat. Cam on third and eight. Getting out of the pocket. Late throw underneath to Ebron once again. How many catches is Eric Ebron up to? Cam Newton has completed 12 catches. Come on. Seven to Eric Ebron. Yeah, Coos. Yeah, you still can. Change your flight. Fly to Detroit. Go to the All-Star game with us. Lions extend their lead to two scores. Can the Giants offense get anything going inside the red zone? They have been stifled. Two field goals and a turnover. First and ten. Play action pass. Foot's got the crossing route. Put it on the money. That's Odell. 40-35. Spin move out of bounds. Big shout out. To Jarvis, BTW is awesome. Shout out to Jarvis. You are awesome. That's a nice play. This is what the Lions have been able to do. They've given up some yards, but then all of a sudden, they'll take... They'll, the Lions only have two sacks, but the two sacks have been huge consequences because it stops all the momentum. If I'm the Giants here on second and 16, you just got to run the ball. Get the ball to Saquon Barkley. Get back some of that, then go to the third down. See you, dubs. Cover two with a stack sack again. There's the run for Barkley. He missed his hole. He had probably 10 yards and just ran into his own blocker. Now a third and 12, but it does it does cut it down. Big difference between a third and 12 and third and 17. Third down and 12. Three wide over to the left side. Barkley on the right hip of Graham Foot. Who has not been able to get anything going. Lines looks like they're going to be sending a corner blitz from the left side. Beckham, Perriman, and Porter. Shout out to T-Ports, who's on the field. Good block there from Barkley. Looks over the middle of the field. A, that was a horrible read. That was so bad. That should have been picked off. That was a horrible read. But the Giants look like they're going to be able to settle for a field goal. Be 51 yards from here. Yeah, you just heard it. Some, some, I don't know if you guys heard that. Somebody goes, what are you doing? Field goal keeps him alive, though. If he makes it. Kick is up. Doesn't make it. It's short. Ball don't lie. Ball don't lie. Lions can get the ball to the 41-yard line. This ball game may be over. Let me know what you think in the chat. One, if you think it's over. Two, if you think the Lions... Or if you think the Giants still have a chance. It's a big miss on a field goal. First down and 10. Oh, we got a GG's. We got GG's already in the chat. Newton underneath. That's Corey Coleman. Nice tackle made, but boy, this Giants offense looks so bad. Jamie's saying that they got a chance. If they hold them to a field goal on this drive, they got a good chance. But I just don't trust this offense right now. I, don't know, I remember the Giants used to have a good offense. Where, where has that gone? Dropping back, Cam, waiting, looking. Oh, good defense. I don't know if you saw that. The user just stayed underneath that with that cover three. Jumped all the way back to stop that, that crossing route and gave just enough time for the, uh, the, the defense to get there. Big third and three. So, uh, Jamie, I, I thought you had a hope. It's okay. 
It's like post cross. I'll be running cover too if I'm if I'm uh, if I'm cringy. It's got B. Boy, the 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 D line's got to get there. Spin move, touchdown. Lines into the end zone. Boy, the D line for the Giants. Remember when that was a strength? It's been pathetic today. Only one sack hasn't forced any pressure. When you let Nate Logan get that wide open, the lines are gonna run all over you. Wait, hold on. I think I can do this. There you go. Your back is a mod. You can create polls again. Don't don't test my uh, my stream labs. Now it's GG's. Woo! Gub, is there another game? No. If there's another game, we'd be showing it, you dingus. First and ten. That's an 18 point game. Lions running away with this one. Wow, great user on the underneath. Woo! Okay. Well, it was a good read, but it worked. Apparently, when you uh, ban somebody, you take away their mod powers. Uh, it's great, Twitch. I love it. No, you can't make a joke, sir. First and 10. A little motion. There was not a single block out there. We still got a fourth quarter, guys. Got any reruns of Friends you guys want to watch? Yeah, it's been it's been locked down. As we'll hit the fourth quarter, force up in the chat. It is all Lions. Leave it to Bomber and Cringe to give me a late night ten o'clock game and then put up a stinker. Thanks a lot, guys. Well, let's take a look at the schedule. Let's see, uh, let's see what we what options we might have for uh, next week's NBA Live Wednesday night, week nine action. Chiefs, Bucks, Giants, Browns. Although I don't know if I want to see this Giants team again after this performance. Forearm shiver. Oh my lord. Uh, Seahawks, Panthers will be a good game. Steelers, Raiders will be a good game. We've got a lot of options. It's a nice week nine schedule. The final season of Madden 19. Yeah, OBJ's dead. Absolutely dead. Stream COD. <laughs> no, I came back into town now. Nobody wants to play COD anymore. Welcome to my life. It's like high school all over again. Right side. Saquon. Oh, he's got room up the sidelines. 15, 10. One guy to beat. Nice tackle made at the 10 yard line, but you can't let Saquon get that much room. Giants, they're going to stay alive. They need to score, and they need to score right now. I like the Ravens buy game. I like the buy in that one, though. How long are the Seahawks gone? Like forever? First and 10. Play action. High pass. Nobody home. Looking for uh, Evan Ingram. Haven't heard of Ingram's name called uh, today. Scarlet Knight saying down 18, seeing weirder things happen. I mean, it's a three score game. You, you, you get a tutty. You just gotta, you gotta get a defensive stop. Then get another tutty, and then all of a sudden it's a ball game. There's still plenty of time. NBL rules, you can't kill the clock until under the two-minute warning, so there's still plenty of time. But as you see by the view numbers, everybody's sort of expecting Bomber to clamp this one down. Is he running engage eight? I don't know. This is just a really weird zone blitz. It looked like it, because all I saw were the three big blues, and I was like, huh, interesting. It's got some ASMR channel straight. Blitz from the left side, blitz up the middle, takes the sack. What are you guys doing? What's going on with you? Make sure you sign up. I'm checking on the, uh, let's see if we've, we've gained any numbers uh, for the EA Access Tournament uh, since we started this broadcast. We were almost, at, we were right at 40. Play action pass. 
Sacked again. We're above 40 now. We got some... Some of our guys have... Uh, Y'all shown up? Love it. Let's see. Right now we got 29 Xbox One, 12 on the PS4. Two people apparently don't have EA access. I just want to let you guys know. If you do apply for the EA access tournament and you answer no to do you have EA access, we ignore your, your response. Just get EA access. Just get it. Fourth and long. Uh, if the Giants don't, don't score here, we might be out of here. Like, <laughs> he hit him with the Madden 18 cheese. I love it. Hit him with the Madden 18 30-yard out route for the tutty. Put your serps in the chat because he cooking. Oh, that Madden 18 cheese. Ah, oh, don't you look foolish. He did take points. He just took a touchdown. Ball game ain't over yet. Trash need a defensive stop. And if there's one thing that works for them, it's the Lions' rushing attack is, is bad. Yeah, Port, I don't get it. Like, I'm going to apply for the EAX tournament. Do you have EA access? No. It's $4.99. If you don't have it, get it right now. You'll only pay $9 for the next two months, and you can get some games discounted. No. He, uh, he only had six points. Camp sacked. That should have been fumble or a pick. Lucky it's not either. Stops the clock at 431. Uh, tournament July 25th to the 30th. Xbox One and PS4 for the first time ever. It's going to be awesome. Second down to 10. Newton in the pistol. Looks like they're going to be throwing it again. They just don't have a rushing attack. And they're trying to put this ball game away. Can the Giants get a stop? Play action. It's the post route. You just got to know, that is a Lions staple. As Hopkins makes a man miss. That's a Lions staple out of that pistol. It's the play action, skin slant, or the option pass, whichever one it is. It's just a post route on the left side. It's an easy first read. And you, you just got to know that. It's called scouting. First down and 10. Gonna be looking to throw it once again. He's gonna be looking for Coleman on the slant route underneath. Good coverage. He's got A over the middle. Gotta make a hit. Does make a hit on Eric Ebron. Big hit. Reezy saying Palmer's O line can't handle play actions against Giants D line. Giants D line's been pretty bad today. No, that's not classic Ebron, Scarlet Knight. Classic Ebron would be if he didn't get hit and he still dropped the ball because that's classic Ebron. Stone hands Magoo. Second and 10. Good check on the... Wow, I'm surprised he went to Henry out there. He had Coleman wide open. It was a good check early on. I think that check took Bomber off the slant route because he just straight up, just four yards out, checked him. And he throws it. But once he got past it, there was nobody in the middle of the field. Third and eight. Giants can stop here. Ball game ain't over yet, folks. Switch route on the outside. Going to probably hot route Ebron to a slant route. Hot route's Coleman to a curl. He's going to take a timeout. That was a mess. That was a mess of hot routes from Bomber. Game master, I think it was just 100%. That's why you check receivers down there, especially with when you don't have when you have a good defensive line. You get people thinking. Bombers going through his projection, pro, uh, going through his progression. Checks him, he gets off that read immediately because he thinks the slant route won't get open over the middle because it makes it look like man coverage. Third down and eight. How about a blitz? Oh, hit as he threw. Giants got to stop. They're still alive. There is life in New York. 
Cougs, you'll like my application. I'm scared. Did you just respond? Shout out to somebody who applied. Reezy, why did you apply twice? I'm scared to read Cougs. <laughs> Alright, I enjoyed it. Fair play. Fair play. I enjoyed it. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Fourth and eight. Lines are going to go for it. They want to put this ball game away. Cam dropping. Hit as he threw. Looking for Ebron. Batted down. Turnover. What a surprising call. Listen, I know you're looking to, to make a play. I know you're looking to put the game away. I know you trust your offense, but... The way your defense has played against the Giants offense really bottled them up. I'm surprised you take that risk. Now you give the Giants great field position. They just need to get into field goal range, kick a field goal, it's a one-score game, or you get your touchdown. You're looking for six here. But maybe you trust your defense. If you're the Lions, I'm probably trusting my defense. Just look, another sack. Because what did he run? Four verticals? Yeah, what a horrible play call. I mean, like, how do you not make that play? I don't I don't understand why you're calling that. Whatever. I like to call a punt. How much does he actually gain? If he puts it inside the 10-yard line, he makes him go 90 yards for a touchdown. Yeah, I don't know where he was looking there. Cringe, cringe ain't on his game right now. Where are you looking, Cringe? Slice defense is good, but they're not magic. You just gotta throw the damn ball. I guess this is why Bomber looks like a genius going for it there on fourth down because the Lion the Giants have no idea how to move the ball. They got nothing. They are just baffled. Third and twenty seven, low gun punch. We got a little buck sale action, maybe? Is that what you're looking for? I mean, Look at how ba far back these guys have been dropped. You have to take something underneath, pick up 10, and get to a fourth down. Or you're going to try to pick it all up, and you're going to overthrow it. I didn't like any of those animations. GG's in the chat. It was not pretty, exclaim. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Still more than 15 seconds left. Yeah, if if uh, if uh, the bomber turns the ball over and then uh, the Giants score and then the Giants kick it deep and then strip the ball deep, because they decided that a uh, uh, an onside kick wasn't the choice, and, and they get the, that, and they score, and then it's overtime. Yeah, you're right. Gov, it could happen. Uh, Rick Flair, have a great night, brother. Thanks for tuning in. Anybody checking on the Raptors game, by the way? Huh? Warriors up six? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why you start Kevin Durant in that game, by the way. Like, I get you want to win on all that jazz, but I don't get it. I don't know. Because you're you're just you're setting yourself up for him to get injured like that, especially with how how bad everybody says the calf slash Achilles injury was. I, I don't know why you, you risk that with your, your star player. Third and 12. Hand off to Eckler, left side. Stays in balance, picks up six. Giants use their second timeout, and they're going to get the ball back. Yeah, Warriors are up. I mean, they have Clay and Steph. It's still a really good team. It could be. Ooh. I know KD wanted to play, but there, there comes a point... I get the NBA is a star-driven league, and I get coaches don't really mean a whole lot. See Eric Spolstra. But at some point, 
Steve Kerr sit there and go, listen, Kev. You, you can't. We're not losing our horse. Because Durant, I mean, if, I, if I'm if I'm Steve Kerr, I'm going, we got to make sure you're at, you know, let's, you don't need to be 100%, but 90%. And they knew it was an Achilles injury. It wasn't a calf. It, it was it was an Achilles. I just, I'm just saying. I wouldn't have, but, you know, who knows? Steve Kerr makes more money than I do. First and 10, foot over the middle of the field. It's another overthrow. God, Grand Foot's bad. Grand Foot's bad. He's no Jordan Foot, am I right? Let me know if you love your Jordan Foot's in the chat. Jordan Foot's? Jordan Feet? I'm going to call him. I'm going to say Jordan Feet. Middle of the field. Culberson just didn't want that ball. Didn't didn't want it at all. Yeah, so I guess if he's leaving anyways, like you go, hey, hurt yourself. What do we care? Stay out of the West. Third down and ten. Shotgun formation. On life support. Down eleven. But we saw a gov blow a game like this, so who knows? Left side. Oh, good swat. Fourth down. Hey, go for stop. Why are you went for the one-handed catch with an open post round? I'm not really sure, but. Culberson trying to get that sports center. Ba -na -na, na -na -na. Fourth down and ten. Ooh. Looks like the line's going to bring a blitz from the left side. It's picked up nicely. Looks over the middle. Still threw it right his hands. All right, that's the ball game. GG's in the chat. Line's going to come over with a 24-13 to 13 win. Giants fans are booing. Uh, before we get out of here, let's remind everybody one more time. Make sure that you apply for EA Access Tournaments at 365.madambombly.com. Actually, I got to... There you go, straight up, 365.madambarmly.com. Click on the EA Access tab. Scarlet Knight, thanks for joining us. Appreciate everybody hung out with us. A little late night MBL action. Free tournament, it's all for charity. Make sure you apply. Make sure you apply early because the, the applications are rolling in. We're going to get out of here. Join us on Wednesday night, 9 o'clock Eastern time for another edition of MBL Live. We appreciate each and every one of you who hung out with us. Uh, have a wonderful night. Shout out to Jordan Foote. That's what we're going to end on. See you next time right here on MBL Live. I just want to say, man, this is T.O., cover athlete of the Madden 19 Hall of Fame edition, and you're watching the gold standard of the franchise mode, the MBL Network. Holla.